if you intend to decommission, sell or give away your Google TV streamer. Before you do, you need to perform a factory reset. This is because a factory reset will not only wipe your data and any settings from the device, it will also deregister your TV streamer from your Google account. Before performing a factory reset, you need to ensure that your Google TV streamer is connected to a television and the internet. The easiest way to factory reset a Google TV streamer is through its user interface. So from the Google TV home screen, if we open Settings, within Settings, we need to locate and choose the option System. From within System, we now need to select About. From within About, we now need to click on Factory Reset and choose the option Factory Reset. Now from within Factory Reset, we need to select Erase Everything in order to initiate the Factory Reset process. The alternative way to perform a Factory Reset on a Google TV streamer is from the device itself. If we take a look at the back of the device, next to the power port, we have a reset switch. So with the Google TV streamer powered on, if we press and hold down the reset switch for between 10 to 12 seconds, or until the LED light turns to a solid orange, when we release the reset switch, our TV streamer will begin to perform a factory reset. It's important to note that while your Google TV streamer is being factory reset, you should not remove the power or attempt to switch it off. This is because, by doing so, you could damage the streamer's operating system, making the device inoperable. You will know that your TV streamer has completed its factory reset when you are prompted to pair the controller. It is at this stage that it is now safe to either power down or reconfigure your Google TV streamer.